Let me just repeat some ground rules for those of you new to endurance races. You gotta cover as much ground as possible within the time frame. When the time's up, we have our winner. <laughs> How much time remaining? Don't worry. Sing what? Damn. Yeah. Man, doctor gave me some sort of vitamin hydration boost, normally reserved for the driver. It's me. I'm here now, ready to meet up with Sierra Knox. Oh, my head. Some guy jumped me. He stole my mascot out. The race is entering its final lap, 47. Sorry, buddy. Can't let you in. You're here for the meeting with Miss Knox. Come back after the race. What is it? Dusky Lane. Bad Lane. Forty-seven. The race is over. Sierra will be coming off the track any time now. Outfit. It really brings out your eyes. Just not informing you, BJ. She has to make sure you brought the documents. So, did you bring the documents? I have the papers right here. Excellent. Come on in. Have a seat or something. I'll let Miss Knox know you're here. We still have a little time before our champion reaches the podium. Let's hope it's not like. your name. Names are for friends. Very well. Straight to the point and all business. Walk with me. Where are we going? Don't worry. What am I gonna do? Kill you in broad daylight. I just want a bit of privacy here. Not about to do sensitive business like this in front of an audience. Good idea. So just to get this straight, you claimed in your email to have somehow found internal reports that show Kronstadt's involvement in the Tungan Valley Massacre. Sounds about right. Let's be clear. You and I are having this meeting because my father doesn't need to know about this. It's just another undesired distraction. I don't care if the information is true or false. I don't care if it mentions moving money from the Nexus project into Tungan Valley Damage Control, as you claimed in your correspondence. I do care about protecting my father, which is why you and I are now here. I see. Leave me alone for a few minutes, guys. Sure thing, Miss Knox. Uh, if you need us, just call. We're right around the corner. So here's the deal. You hand over the documents and leave, and that's the end of it. And you will do that now. So here are the two possible outcomes of this meeting. One, you will leave this place and this country for good, and that will be the end of it. Everyone lives happily ever after. Two, you don't choose option one. Someone dies. Target down. 
Next up, Robert Knox.